Hello there and welcome back to Cory Loses, where today we are once again continuing our Fall of the Republic 1.3 pre or 1.4 preview playthrough as the Galactic Republic. In the last episode, we finished off with a defense on Kashyyyk, which sadly happened before our hypervelocity gun was ready. But Pelion is on the way, trying to get there before the ground invasion starts. We're probably not going to make it, uh, but we'll see. We do have some units here that can that can fight. We have a barracks. We have a okay. So like there, there's it. It's 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 over. It's over. Never mind. It's, it's but we'll we'll see. We'll see if it if we can make it not over. So we are gonna move you over there. We've got some venators building. We've got a vendor building. Hellion was going to be going up to Mandalore, but the Wookiees need was greater. And they're going to Bothawai as well, but this is... Oh, the Republic thinks they have beaten me, but I have returned with a new flagship. Mandible, mandible, mandible. French has returned in control of a Providence Dreadnought. So he's he's here somewhere. But he'll be coming around the mountain when he comes. So. I think we're going to try to move into Bothawai with some of these Botha guys. And we did actually make it to Kashyyyk. We got the hypervelocity gun in there. So we'll probably move Hauser back in. Because Pelion is going to be going up to uh, up to Mandalore. So we need to get up to Tool. Uh Uga Kuga Dur is there's Thorte the fifth. Choose your reinforcements. Let's jump in. Alright. Uh well I wanted to use the on your the command. Procurator, Karakalakin. Oh, it's right here. Say my name, come on in. We got another new ship. Hopefully it, it lasts longer than our... Uh, than our first attempt at the Maelstrom did. We've got... Hypervelocity gun here. We've got a lot of ships of our own. I think... Like, we should be able to... Just drop a bunch of anti-fighter or anti-fighter adjacent stuff. We have the command bonuses. And did we actually hit anything there? I don't I don't know. This is a, a more than full fleet, too. So there's a little bit of carefulness that has to be aired for. But, like, I, I think we have, between the command bonus, between our own fighters, I'm not, I'm not super worried about it. I'll, I'll make sure the, uh, the stats get shown on screen here for the Procurator. One of the older, pre-war big boy ships that Kuat put out, uh, that people wanted to defend their systems with before the Clone Wars, which is actually something I talked about a little bit in the most recent video that was released on Cory's Datapad, my lore channel. You can subscribe both here and there for more Star Wars content. Isn't that great? I feel dirty now. But do it. Don't make that be for nothing. Okay. Uh, we still have the bombers here. Well, we actually, we have held up that line pretty well. Like, our, our fighters are making it through. Their bombers are not. So, I am actually fairly happy about this. Yeah, I just need to make sure you don't go too far up. Alright, we don't need to... You don't need to all go for one. That's actually a big waste of... Big waste of resources. The more I can get you to spread out, actually, the... Uh, the better we'll be. Alright, if you're gonna loop around this way, I've got some bad news for you. That's 2400, that's 1960, okay. You know what? I'm gonna see if I can get more than one thing. Oh, that's gonna be a, just a waste. Oh well. I think the, the way the battle is currently going, I don't need to... I don't need to min-max my HVs, if you know what I mean. What I mean is my hypervelocity gun. 
The missile launchers are the primary uh, target. We've done a target. Darn right. We don't have anything to stop them from retreating, but I don't think that's a a huge problem because if they do try to retreat, we got we got vision of all engines. We're in attack range. We just need to. It's that munificent that's in the back here that we're probably not going to be able to to kill that way. So if I can get okay, you just missed everything. Come on, bombs. There you go. That did slightly better. Alright, uh, let's get the bombers over to that recusal. Losing the, uh, what's it called? Losing the space stuff is not quite what I was hoping for, because I, I do want to build up our influence as much as I can. Because we want to get the, the fun, the chic influence unit that's been added. With Toblerone's model. We've got you, and then there's Lupus left. So I think that's I think that's a win. So we did lose a lot on the defense at first, including the structures. We didn't lose the heroes, so nothing that we can't replace got lost. Uh, so you know that's that's a f that's fine. Um, let's get back around here. I know that you're there on in space. Okay, we were never going to get in there, and that's actually too much. We weren't going to be able to defend that either. At least in space. So, let's see if we can actually kill any of those. Here we ought to have a hypervelocity gun. It does. It's as built up in space as it reasonably can be, other than if we got you. Um, I just need to make sure that I'm getting as much of this together as I can. Well, maybe I get the, the other Praetor, get some mobility. I think we're going to get that, that second Praetor. What do we have in the ship market right now? Yeah, just that Praetor, I think. No, that would actually be a third Praetor. But we don't have a third Patron Praetor. So I'll just ignore that for the moment. Uh, like, hypervelocity guns would be... Would be the ideal situation here. But clearly that's not an option. So, around in there. We'll get through. Ready to deliver. Got you on the com. Okay. Well, this. I think. Having them spread out like that is okay. I'm just gonna... I'm not gonna try to head them off. Even though it Let's might be... Rocket, hmm. Light no, no, I'm not I'm not gonna try to, to cut them off. They're gonna come in, and then it's gonna be... It's like, if I could kill them early enough, then they'd have the reinforcements jump in and blah, blah, blah. But I'm not sure where they jump in anyways, and I think it's better to be safe on this. So I am going to send the bombers out to that side, and I'm going to start turning you around. Awaiting your orders, sir. We'll crush those scum. Okay. So out of the what, 35? I think it, I think it was like 14 or 19 for the auxilias and the captors. But however many there were, there are now four less. Or fewer. At your command. Heading for attack coordinates. Once again being defeated by the spread. Which again, we have uh, have made some behavioral changes since this playthrough started. I 
basically Bob's uh, Bob's methodology for the AI in both Phoenix Rising when I was doing playthroughs of that and in Thrawn's Revenge. When I succeed with something, that's when it's time to Earth. That's when it, that's when it goes away. Which is fine, you know. We got a lot of bombs coming in there. But they've missed enough of them. Yeah, that was a bunch of Corvettes that you were trying to take out there. That's not going to be your your best life that you're living there. I'm going to try to move these guys back once again. And let's keep going with you forward. Uh, try to stay in there. Okay, that's a lot of damage on that. But we've killed five of those, one of the core ships. So, they're, I'm going to say they're each, like, I think they're like 9 and 11 for the pop cap. 9, 13. Okay, 9 and 13. So... We've killed probably 70 pop cap total so far. Too bad these bombers are getting as much free space as they are. Okay, let's get you guys to proactively get up there. And you need to try to get that. We're gonna get another another few on that. Like once the once the Luker Hulk gets in, it's not gonna be possible for us to win. It's only a battle carrier, but if they're clustered, like if they have enough support in, that's what I'm more worried about than the ship itself. Okay, let's uh let's try to get out of that. Cause, like, it takes less to kill a Lucre Hulk than I think a lot of players really realize, but it's... The ships need to still be alive for that to be a thing. Okay, there's another Munificent coming in there. Killed like seven or eight. Gotta turn you guys around. Like, if we just had four acclimators, that'd be nice. But, like, we're also starting to get overwhelmed by their bombers. So, that's still, that only gets us so far as well. We're not getting any damage out of this right now, obviously, because it's turned around. Okay, let's see if I can focus you on that. I'm going to give you some help from that Carrick. Yeah, there's a Providence coming in behind it. So it's definitely... It's definitely not going to be a victory for us. We're, we're getting enough damage in that I'm not sad about it yet. And I think it is best to to focus on the little guys, rather than trying to take out the Luke Hulk. Because I don't think we're going to be able to get through the Luke Hulk. Although, what I'd also like to kill... No, don't, 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 don't. Do not focus on that Luke Hulk. If I can shoot that, maybe we can take this out and then maybe one or two of the other little guys. Like, I'm not looking to stick around too long at this point. There's no further profit in attacking an enemy. Is 
Okay, let's just try to take down this guy, and then we'll go. You know what? I, if I'm gonna have any chance, I'm gonna keep it now. Damn it, right away. Lost the engines right away. Well, if that's the way it's gonna be. May as well. Okay, well. They win. That's probably 200 or 300 pop caps that we killed there. Mm, probably closer to 200. I didn't realize. I guess we might have auto resolved the, the Praetor, Providence. Rather. Construction complete. Yeah, that was 200 some odd. We're not going to be able to get through with anything. But I think we will get some extra defenses on Camino. Uh, you are part of Mama Zinja's fleet. Yes, sir. And. Okay, we got the. We got in there in time. I don't think we're going to be able to retreat. Or I don't think we're going to be able to stop them because they're going to retreat. Okay, actually I didn't have... I have a Pathfinder and I do have... Yeah, never mind. These are all just dead. I'll take that. Just a nice, a nice gift after what we've been through so far. There we go. You clipped it. Awaiting your order, sir. Consider it history. We got one little transport left. Come on, you can you can hit it. You can't really hit it. You don't have any. Fine. Fine. I'll auto resolve. All right. So I am going to send you guys down Actually, to Kashyyyk. That station started. in, and then. They can technically still come through course in and do more of that, but oh, they're coming with Ventress again. No Dooku this time. We have artillery. This could be held potentially. Like we have two lats and we have two artilleries. So if I can ferry you guys to different landing zones, you need it, sir. Of course. constructing. Ready to help. Where we And we don't really have enough money for more of that, so I shouldn't actually do that. I need you to go. Somewhere where you're a bit less. There you go. Yes, sir. Construction complete. No, my bad. Okay, we're gonna try to get through on that. Deploy there. Cause like I'm gonna try to get this field base. I think it's gonna be the most important part. Don't worry about them. You're going to drop that. Well, am I going to have enough money for the field base plus that? No. So I think what I'm going to do is sell this turret. I'm going to drop you there. Come on, you got the vet. You got the vet. Roger that. Ready for action. Attack that target. Under attack. Form up. Are they all stuck yes, in there? Sir. No. Heading out. Coming out. Fall out. Yes, Commander. Okay, now away you go. Squad Just get out of there. Take that if you got to. You guys come around. And get out of here. 
Lancet standing by. Lancet proceeding. Okay, we want repairs. You're all walking out. You're coming over. You gotta heal. You are gonna do the same thing. You're gonna come over here. Okay, now let's find a place to drop you off. I think we gotta get outside of this. We're not going to be able to stop them from... Oh, it's EAW-ing. Okay, nothing I can do. Where's the vat? The vat's here. We don't need the to protect this, but if I can just take advantage of the focus on the shields to... Give us some time to, to shoot. Alright. Get out of there. That should save us some. Like if we can find Ventress before she finds us. There's, I guess there's no reason. Oh shit! Ready to receive orders. Unit destroyed. Unit destroyed. Unit destroyed. Oh, all the artillery's gone. And the. Roger that. Yep. Right away. We're done. I was hoping we were like I got very hopeful in the in the second there that we were actually killing those bombers as they came through. That's why I ordered the move back in. Which, I mean, I probably could have stopped the other lat kill. That who wanted to be. The OG9s are the real Gs. This way. Yes, sir. Okay, so it's not it's not gonna be a win. I think I think they win. I mean for the amount of attacks they've done, having this victory does it's not it's not the worst. System lost. Just need to make sure they don't get Obi-Wan, and Anakin, and Delta. They're never gonna be able to do a ground attack on that, actually. But Delta, I could get Delta ready for some raids on some other places, because that's what they're for. They're too high pop to use outside of defense and raids. We'll, we'll make use of that. Uh, but Pelion, you are going to execute order raid the raid Mandalore. Let's just see what they end up having there. I want to check the charts, too. Uh, new generation of recruits. Save to 332. And we'll get some... That's going to be... That's going to be doable. Especially if I can get, like, one more academy. Maybe we'll do that. Okay, it's just the station. If I was being a bit more cautious, I could have spied that out first. But I think we can take the station and that'll set us on our way for... Choose okay. Uh, get the procurator in there. Say my name. I did. Okay, even with the ion cannon, that's fine. We have some chonky ships for this. We have some little ships for this. We just gotta go for the Golan first. And it is a capital shipyard. Which for some reason I just completely forgot that there would be garrisons here. But it's not... 
without any other support, I'm not. I am nonplussed. Or plussed. Unfazed. Relatively plussed. Okay, no, I, I am going to send his trooper there. Thing there. We're going to keep the Arc 170s on that. And. They had a lot of bombers coming out of that, actually. That is a, a thing to be marginally concerned about. Those poor diamonds. By poor diamonds, I mean those damn diamonds. Okay, you gotta, you gotta get that, and then gotta get these other ships. In the way. I need to get you out of there, and then like these bombers gotta screw off. They will woo this day. Yes, General. Captain here. Well, I guess this group is meant for those defenses. We're kind of getting through on. Oh, your your body block, and that's the problem. Yeah, the diamonds are done. Uh, NTBs. There's a 95. Like the, it was a lot of bomber squadrons that they had on that. Okay, well let's start moving towards station. I'd ideally not want to lose any ships in this battle. Okay, let's see. You're actually not going to contribute anything. So let's just make sure if we're sending people in, they're actually healthy and ready to contribute. Not that they'd have nothing to contribute if they weren't healthy in general, but it's just in this particular situation, I need bulky HP. It's just it's just the specific situation in that we're in that I need them to be a specific type of contributing. I don't want to disparage the contributions of the other ships. Let's see how that ends up. Contributing. But it does seem like the, the best option for us is to focus on these northern parts right now. Like, Mandalore is the big shipyard they have in this area. And I don't know if they've gotten the, uh, the Mandalore choice yet. So if we've preempted that, That'll be good. Otherwise, there's going to be some heroes running around that we need to we need to deal with. But what else would there be? I think there is still... I don't even remember what size of map we're playing on. But I'm not 100% sure which, uh, which planet stayed, so... I'm not 100% sure in the shipyard situation other than that. I think it's just this diamond left. Yeah, that's what it looks like. So once that's down, we are victorious. All right. Got ourselves space over Mandalore. We're going to need to get a ground force in. We'll probably separate Ramcota. We lost Craft GPT and Sephi's Bane. That's actually kind of sad. Uh, but we'll, we'll deal with actually invading Mandalore next time. We'll probably take Coda. Or we can actually just use the Core to Six Garrison, though I don't want to remove them. I think we will use them, though. And like I'll divide this other army in the Core up into other constituent parts while we keep moving towards our second Praetor and a few more other ships. But that is going to do it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you are enjoying the series so far, and I hope to see you next time. Bye, everyone.